the goal is to get the students in Swanson involved with uh, the environment, like aware of the problems that the environment has and trying to help the community and the environment they live in. Um, and so to do that, we had a, a program called Growing Native, where we had students bring in acorns to uh, so that we could give them this uh, organization, Growing Native, so that they would replant them in Arlington. Growing Native is an organization that helps the environment, especially with soil erosion, and what they do is collect acorns and then plant them, <coughs> and trees help go against soil erosion. And so what we did was plan an activity where students would bring in acorns and we would count them, collect them, and then give them to Growing Native so they could plant them into trees. And so we asked students to bring in um, acorns and um, we counted them up. We put them all in different sized bags and figured out um, the weight, like how many acorns for a certain number of pounds and then calculated the rest that way. Um, and then we sent them over to where they were collecting it and um, we reached our goal by a lot. In the Potomac Basin region, we planted all the acorns that we collected to plant trees and to help make it a greener place, more oxygen, more wildlife to thrive. We do a lot of green things and our goal is just to help the environment encourage and encourage others to do so as well. Well, here we're making bird feeders and bird houses, so here are just a few examples. And it's like to show people what they can do with recycled materials and everything that will help the environment. So yeah, these are examples that we've been showing the school. Well, I think it's important because like there's a lot of stuff that people get rid of and a lot of that stuff can be reused and so it sort of goes into the landfills and like messes up with like the environment. So if we can like use those materials to like help other like the environment and nature around us. Yeah, well we're gonna pick like a few winners from for like a few categories and everything. And then those bird feeders get put up in our front lawn outside Swanson. And so that's to give like the, the animals like food and everything. So yeah, to keep it good for like the winter. Well, kids are like the future and it's just really good that to know to take care of the world. And I mean, we don't want to end up in this horrible place because everything we do affects everything around us. I think that everyone should focus on it, especially young people like us, because soon we're going to be making major decisions and voting and everything and making green decisions, and it's our world, and we have to take responsibility for it. Um, it really matters around the world because we have to take care of the place of where we live, and you know, so uh, no matter where you live, this will have a huge impact. Uh, studying the environment is hugely important. Well, I think it's good because here we have a lot of students and so with a lot of people, once they get aware of like the problems and how to fix it, then they can go off and like help everyone else in, in other parts of the nation and like even other parts of the world. So it's good that we know like the basics and how to help that and so. I think that it's really important to keep <coughs> our ecosystem the way it is because we, we need oxygen, the animals around us need oxygen, and it's just a better life to have a greener life. <laughs>